Bobby, this is Bob, there might be some hesitation. This is Bobby Ryan, one of the easiest interviews Good Morning Gloucester's ever ever experienced. Because you love your product, and when you love your product, it's easy to talk about, right? Well, you get the passion. You know, you start. You're trying to introduce something new, something to the economy, and and you feel a little proud of yourself. It it really goes back to colonial age when you when you start something new. Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to talk about something. Speaking of something new, nice segue. You just was it yesterday? Uh, Monday, last Monday. Last Monday, with the release of the Knockabout Gin. And the Knockabout Gin, the reason I'm down here at, at uh, Captain Joe and Sons, is to uh, present you with a bottle of our Knockabout. There it is. And uh, let's check know. out the label. We'll get a we'll get a nice up close for people so they could recognize it at the stores. Knockabout Gin. Who took the picture? That. Um, you know, that picture actually belongs to Bowden now. Oh, okay. Bowden. Yeah, I just and, did an interview with him a couple and days that ago. That is the, uh, that's the adventure when she had a black hull oh. before she came in for to be reconditioned. And uh, I think that's during one of the Mayor's Cup races, uh, you know, a couple of decades ago. Very apropos. Well, that's, a, that's why we named it Knockabout. Great. That's the design yeah. uh, of, the, of, of the vessels, that engineering to help save fishermen's lives. If uh, for the folks that don't know, it means the bow spread. They pretty much when fishermen started to become a little more valuable, there was a long time when the owners thought of them as disposable. <laughs> and you know, you could go down and always pick up four or five guys if you wanted. And uh, this is when you know diesel engines were starting to be installed. Yeah. So you needed more talent. You needed engineering. Now you needed uh, people that could deal with with uh, the new electronics that were coming out. So the fishermen weren't so disposable. So they didn't want to lose the fishermen to the sea by having to do their nautical work out in the bowsprit, out in the heavy North Atlantic. So this is every industry has their widow maker, and the bowsprit on these on these schooners were the widow maker of the fishing industry. Uh -huh. uh, lost a lot of men out there on that. So the owners extended the bow. Uh, the sails can come down to the front, and. Uh, the name Knockabout, of course, also. So when you can pack 400 of these in Gloucester Harbor, you didn't. You could pack them tighter and knock about, so ah, to speak. Ah, I see. So uh, you know, pack them like sardines, and you wouldn't have the bowsprit getting into the. Uh, Take it up space. The next, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you pack them tighter. But that's on the outside. Yep. On the inside, we're pretty proud of what we do here, <laughs> and 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 uh, Knockabout Gin. We have 10 botanicals in there four or five of them are common to all the others and then I happen to like a little like a little bit of taste of citrus so we have two citruses in here uh, orange and uh, lemon oh. and uh, it's a little bit more complicated in the process when you're dealing with that but we do it and we're mom and pop down there so we can do it and uh, yep we launched this last Monday it's in the package stores it's in uh, all around and, and we're starting to hit the restaurants now with it. That's fantastic. So it's got a little bit of a citrus hint to it so you could probably drink this with it. You don't have to put the uh, the accoutrements with it. You could just go... Well, um, that, but it also, when you do rim a martini glass with a twist, twist of lime It enhances like that, it? Brings it right out. Yeah. And when you make your gin and tonic if you have a fresh tonic or quinine that you mix it with um, it pops. It gets nice and sweet, and, and oh the citrus. Oh my God! Pops I'm dying out. to pull myself one right now. Well, you, you know, there's only <laughs> one way to handle that. <laughs> no, I know. Get right to it. Oh goodness. But boy, don't you have a beautiful day here? Look at this. Yeah. This, Go this down to Captain Joe's. It's, I'm lucky. We're lucky to be our own bosses down yeah. here. Yeah. So. So uh, along with that, so am I up there. But. Um, so tell me about. Let's talk about the website quickly. Website www.ryanandwood.com. Do you have scheduled tours up there? We pretty much um, on a pamphlet that we hand out. We say 10 o'clock Thursday, Friday, and Saturday morning. Mm -hmm. But if somebody's in the neighborhood, I'm not going to refuse walking them through. You pop by and, uh, and yep. there you go. You still have those uh, wood chips there that for the smoking? We do. Yeah, we do. We're now selling them for three three dollars a bag. Oh, good. You get two pounds for three dollars. These are the uh, used. Jack Daniel barrels that we put our rum in and some whiskey in, and if a barrel fails or, or we think it's not reporting to us, we chop it up into little bits, call them barrel bits. Yep. Two or three of those in with your barbecue, you know, you soak them a little bit while, you get the oak. You get you, the you oak. You get it nice. All yeah. right. Very good. Bobby, thanks for coming down. Appreciate it. And uh, we'll see you. Any other, listen, any other updates you have for us, we want to be your source right here. All right, all right. The, launch, the launch platform? Yeah, that's right. Very good, very good. I appreciate it. <laughs> thanks, Thank you. Thanks, Bobby.